Um, the, the, that night you said you saw that uh, Bev, I uh, can't remember the officer's name, the police officer? Hosker. Hosker, um, yes. take out of the trunk what appeared to be two bleach bottles? Yes. Do you have any idea what those may have been for or did you see what they I were didn't used for? I didn't see, I learned later uh, through talking to other people that the body had been bleached, so uh, froze. Uh, in order to set the time of death off. So that's what you're implying that happened? I believe because she left the Brotherhood of the RCMP that they were scared that she would come forward because she could, she could, uh, yes, conscience. Like Jim Jensen, uh, the one that was running the Argo, uh, he stated to my mother uh, just previous to, to quitting the police force in Quinell, and going to work for Argo, he stated to her that uh, this was the most corrupt police force in all of Canada. And that was the reason for him leaving, because I believe that they all have knowledge that these murders are, are taking place and they are covering it up because if one's made to look bad, like if you implicate a, a cop as a serial killer, it's gonna make them all look bad. Mm -hmm. So you, do you think they're getting orders from higher up? Or do you think it's just a... I, I believe that from what, what I've been through and, and all the police stations that I've talked to, that it is being covered up from the, the toppest ranks of the RCMP. Well, actually, uh, like they just totally destroyed my credibility. Uh, they've done everything to, to say that, I was, I've been, that I've been crazy. Uh, I have no reason to lie over this. Like. The only thing they've tried to do is murder me. Like, other than that, I hadn't. I've never had many run-ins with the law. I had trouble. When, I was in trouble when I was a kid, but uh, that was when I was 18 years old and out on the street. And I had been working for 14 years, uh, running a silver culture company, doing danger falling, and and we had uh, seven, eight employees sometimes that I'd have to. To, to be foreman over. I even, I even went to mental health after all this and, and, uh, and spoke with a counselor. And he, took, he even said, well, this, this, this doesn't sound right, what you're telling me. And he sent me up for a brain scan in Prince George. There was nothing wrong. There's nothing wrong with my brain. Like it, it functions quite well. <laughs> Do you have any uh, recent criminal reports? Say in the last 15 years or so? Uh, I have two impaired uh, in the last 15 years, and uh, the last last impaired was them trying to trap me out of my house. Uh, at the time when I got the impaired, when they said that I blew the breathalyzer, I wasn't even in the police station at that time. I had already been gone. Uh, I'd only had three beer, and yet it said that I blew point one four and one five, and all they were trying to do was entrap me out at my property out rural, and so that I couldn't travel anywhere. And they took my the superintendent of motor vehicles just took my my driver's license for a period of three years, so now I'm stranded. Like I don't I don't drive. Uh, 2000, took them two and a half years to put me into court. Uh, it was a month, a month before they tried killing me. Yeah, the, they give me, given me the impaired. Yeah, and you automatically, you got, you got 21 days to appeal it, which I did, and for work purposes, and I was denied and then you automatically lose it for 90 days, and it was during that 90 days that, that they come and try to murder me in my house. And on that night that they tried to murder you, when afterwards you went and spoke to all of those people, have any of those people given you statements, or would they give you statements? Yes, I believe that they would. Right. And uh, these people are still available and alive? And, yeah. uh, except for Dorothy, Do Do Dorothy just passed away, but the rest of my witnesses, that. That, that I that I actually am scared to say their, yeah. their, names. their names because 
of the threat against them. Yes. Saying that story immediately after that. Event. Yes. 